Hello guys, welcome to Electronics Engineering. I know many of you having the old laptop battery, which is not working for your laptop. So today we are going to make a 13,000 mAh power bank of it. So let's start. Firstly talk about the requirements. An old laptop battery. A XL6009 boost converter. A TP4056 charging module, a toggle switch, a female USB port, some wire for connection, some LEDs. And a 2.2K register. Firstly, open the battery. After applying some muscular force, we have successfully opened the battery. Now we have six lithium ion cells. Now remove all of the stuff from it. So, so now we have six individual lithium ion cell. Now measure the voltage across each cell. If it is nearly lie between 3.5 to 3.9 volt, then your cell is pretty good to be a part of your power bank. My all the cells are provided the good source of voltage so I am gonna use all of them. Before going to the connection you must go for the data sheet of the cell. There you find out the current providing capacity of the cell which is given in milliampere. I find out 2200 mAh for this cell. That means it's provide 2200 milliampere current in one hour. So if you want to make a good capacity power bank then we must connect the all six of them in parallel. So here we go for the cell connection. Now move on the circuit diagram, firstly connect the output of the battery to the input of the charging module, then the positive terminal connect to the first pin of the toggle switch, then second pin of the toggle switch connects to the 
पॉजिटिव इनपुट ऑफ द बूस्ट कन्वर्टर देन नेगेटिव टर्मिनल कनेक्ट टू द नेगेटिव इनपुट ऑफ बूस्ट कन्वर्टर देन कनेक्ट द आउटपुट ऑफ बूस्ट कन्वर्टर टू द फीमेल यू एस बी पोर्ट नाउ कनेक्ट ऑल द स्टफ अकॉर्डिंग टू द सर्किट डायग्राम Now set the output of the boost converter at 5 volt. The output of the boost converter connect to the first and the fourth pin of USB port. So our circuit is ready. Now move on some finishing work. Here I use my old mobile phone box, which is good enough for outer case of power bank. Then mark the dimension of the USB port, the micro USB port, LEDs and toggle switch, and cut it out. Then place the complete circuitry inside it. Finally, we placed all of the stuff inside the box. Now our power bank is ready to use. So let's see. and now it's work like a charm 
Now we close the uppercase of power bank. Now the job is done. I hope you understand the complete procedure of making the power bank. Now many of you are thinking about the making your own power bank. Please like, comment and share the video. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel.